So today is part three of what to do if you don't like your child's therapist. Um, it's a sensitive topic, so let's get into it. You gotta talk to the therapist, okay? Not to their boss, at least not at first, and not to the mom in the waiting area that's become your girlfriend, okay? You gotta talk to the therapist. Now, normally I would say, go ahead, sit down, make an appointment, talk about your concerns, but in this case, if the therapist is doing something that you don't like, you gotta nip it in the bud in the moment. Because if you don't, it's gonna escalate into this big thing and then you're gonna get angry and then you're gonna blow up and everybody in the office is gonna think you're crazy, okay? It's the truth. So, what I want you to do is, when the therapist is doing or saying something that you don't like, I want you to say this. I don't like that you're doing that with my child. I don't like that you're saying that to my child or can you use a different tone of voice when you speak to my child? And sometimes it's just the little things that you say that can mean so much. Um, and if they want to continue that conversation, the therapist wants to continue that conversation, continue the conversation, have the conversation. Don't back down from the conversation. Uh, continue following me in the series because there's some other things I want to tell you that you can do. Um, I want your child to be their best ever, so I will see you next time.